Max had only um, been at the school a year um, before they had um, uh, learning difficulties. But within this, this new leading class, he's gone sky high. He A year ago, he didn't know how to read a book, but on this day, I could leave him alone and he'll just get on and read a book. So, yeah, I'm very proud of him. And... Do you like coffee and custard on your apple pie? <laughs> just raised the interest in reading to a point that I've never witnessed before. It's had a big impact on behaviour in my class because children that may have been. Um, sort of wiggling down the bottom with their behaviour, niggly behaviour, they come out for half an hour and it gives them a time of reflection as well, away from the class, where they get one-to-one -one attention, so when they come back they're not demanding my attention, be it negative or positive. It's a daily thing, um, the lessons are half an hour and they are very intense with those children um, and it involves working with books very much in text, um, letters, we work with letter work, word work um, and then we introduce new text at the end of the, the session so it's a very intense half an hour and by the end of it the child's exhausted and we're exhausted but it's fantastic so it does get challenging for them and they do find it hard but they also can see the rewards as well you know they you know part of the reading recovery is building their self-esteem um, and and you know and saying to them you can do this it's you know you are a fantastic learner you can solve problems you can work out that word you're not going to know every word like an adult but you can solve them and you know how to do that so you know their self-esteem and their self-confidence goes through the roof really and that's probably well alongside with the reading is a fantastic thing to see It's been very good. Uh, I think the main thing, obviously we read with Angelina at home, we do a story at night and that type of thing, but it's actually just made her enthusiastic for reading, which is brilliant. At the beginning of school you come to school and you learn to read, um, but we say later in school you learn through your reading, you know, and if you haven't got skills to be a good reader and writer, you can't access the wonderful curriculum that lots of schools give you, you know, so really often then you start to get disaffected children or children with very low self-esteem about their whole learning, so, so that can be the long-term impact of not being a good literacy learner. I think the really powerful thing has been that it's been overwhelmingly successful in all different schools because every different school has a different cohort of children and different classroom practice going on. But reading recovery is made to work in any situation, it works in different countries. And what we're seeing in Brighton and Hove is that the lowest attaining children who are selected, about 80% of those children have made accelerated progress, which is that they go from being a non-reader to a reader, a confident reader and writer as well because we work on writing. In this school we have um, three reading recovery teachers and myself so we can teach 14 children at a time and we would get through two cohorts of children in the year so we're hoping to um, work with 28 children in this school. Um, across the local authority we have 18 reading recovery teachers so at a time they're teaching 75 children. 75 children have just come off the programme and we'll teach another 75 children. So in a year that's 150 of the lowest literacy learners in year one. And that will really make a difference to the attainment of children in year two classes. We're hoping. Every school has wanted to continue and every school appreciates I think that the local authority is continuing to invest in the teachers, the children and the programme because everybody sees it's a, a really successful thing to do. Such a massive improvement. It's, yeah, really good. It's really confident now, where we didn't have much confidence before. Um, and I thought it was going to have a bit of trouble with reading and writing. Because you don't really like mixing a lot either. But no, he's, he's done really well, I'm really pleased. Is B5 on your birthday? Billy, Jack, said, and you can come to school.